<laughs> Welcome back to another edition of Dante's Discussion. That's right, this time we are answering the question, more of projecting, showcasing your answers to the question of what is your favorite fashion souls. Of course, this is for Dark Souls 2. Let's see how this works out. A bunch of people gave me awesome answers. A few people gave me some strange answers, I guess, are maybe less than savory answers. So let's just get through them. Let's see how they work out. And not only that, I will pick one of the, I think there's 19. One of the 19 plus I'll add my own in. So one of the 20 uh, for the Fashion Souls red carpet winner. And if you are selected the winner, I don't know, you get brownie points. You you get to say to your, you know, significant other or mother or whoever the hell you are, if you're watching this, uh, hey, look, I'm on this video and I won Fashion Souls. Da, 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 da. You don't get anything. You just get acolytes from me and from other people. So let's see how it works out. Anyways, and if you don't know, I use the Fashion Souls website, fashion-souls.com. Uh, Pretty cool website, amazing that they were able to create this website. Uh, it's not obviously the best, or I wouldn't even say it's uh, as good as the game, but just for a quick fix of getting all the armors, especially if you don't have them all, which I, I don't think I have them all. I think I'm missing a few pieces here and there, but it's just really annoying navigating those menus and it's not as easy to put the video on through here as I'm talking about it, blah, blah, blah. Either way, this should suffice for the most part just keep in mind that things probably look slightly better in game anyways let's go starting off number one elwood p dowd that's right from youtube he says at first i didn't like the from set at all but it's grown on me i use from helm plus chest and havel's hands and legs looks great especially with silver colored weapons like sun sword and watcher shield it uh it's also functional 1k armor never saw except for the 980 something in strike i love one of my favorite things is uh, armors that are useful <laughs> and look good so I personally love function rather than form I don't care what the hell I look like I could look like a pink mess blobby disgusting whatever as long as my stats are better or more functional I am completely fine with it. anyways let's look at it fashion souls 101 101 let's do it right now boom now this is all for Rom set right now. Uh, I'm just looking at not exactly what he has. I will change it just right now, just for y'all. Apple, you can type it in too, which is cool. Uh, well, it wasn't as amazing as I thought. <laughs> Oops. But yeah, Havel's leggings. I mean, obviously it's very functional because Havel's anything is awesome. But you look at this. I think it actually fits together pretty well. I think the Havel's leggings. Um, the gauntlets, I think, work pretty perfectly. The leggings are a little bit too intense for my taste. Maybe that's just me. I don't know. I, I, I'm i interested to see what other people think. Put it in the comments below. Anyways, let's get to the next person. Next combatant, if you will. Kyle Lilly, Xbox Live's Lord Relic, says, From Helm, Night Chest, Glass, Night Gloves, Hate Night Legs, anything that goes together, obviously. All right, let's see if it really does go together. Hmm, I'll be the judge. Whoa, you're skinny. You're a female. Your legs are crazy small. Um, <laughs> it. I think it actually does go to well, uh, go together pretty well. Uh, for some reason, this this chest piece though is a little frumpy for me. Maybe yeah, that's just me. And this middle, I don't know what you call this, like mini skirt thing, doesn't fit as well together with the rest of the set. But I I, I like it overall. I'll say. And it's probably decently functional as well. Let's look at the next one. We'll go back to Fextra Life. Finkelhurst of Lordran says, Call me unoriginal, but I'm a, still a sucker for the full Faram. For my uh, strength build, for my dex build, though I use the Alva set, uh, but with the Hade Knight Iron Mask. Now, this is one of my favorites. Sorry to give you a preview, but boom! I love this helmet with this armor. It fits together almost perfectly like it's a little bit lighter than the rest of the um the the set here the alva set but i mean it's got the red ponytail that goes with the red sort of cape thing and the red sort of skirt thing whatever you want to call them uh i think this goes together goes together really well and i think it's awesome 
definitely doing very well on the red carpet so far. So Finkelhurst of Lordran, uh, you're uh, you're probably the top of the list right now. Anyways, let's go to the next person. Let's go back to YouTube. Seagate says for a full set, I'm partial to North Border set, but the Rogue set always looks uh, looked great to me as well. For mix and match, this is the one we're going with. Grave Warden Bottoms, Ben uh, Ben Hart's Helm, Orgrim, and Leather Gloves. This setup, well, here, he puts a link. Uh, honestly, the fashion options are endless. I completely agree. There's just fashion everywhere. Just all over the place fashion. Let's look at what he had. Now, he didn't name a chess piece, so I'm thinking he's some sort of brawler. Look at this. He's got a taped up foot. He's like, yeah, man, what you want? What you want? I'll kick you with my left foot, my right foot. I don't care. I'll just bandage it up, man. But um, I don't know. I, I get the brawler look if that's what he was going for. But at the same time, not having a full set. This doesn't, I don't know. I don't like this one as much. Maybe that, that's just me personally. You can put it in the comments below. Anyways, let's go to uh, Serge Alexiev. Full Lion Warrior set for female, Executioner set for male, and Rune set for both. I love that he puts one for a gender, one for another gender, and one for both. I think that's pretty awesome. But we're going to go with the both. And like you can see this website, you can see the head poking out a little bit here. And here and the legs here you know the website's not perfect but it's still awesome i can't make a website i really uh commend them for how awesome or him or it might just be one person i think it is actually so that is awesome anyways fashion souls rune helm i'm not the biggest fan of the rune uh garb if you will uh not my favorite i don't like the helmet i think most of all because of its weird like triangular prism deal i don't know it's not it's not for me again put in the comments below tell me what you think i also want to know what people think what they're out of this showcase what they would pick for the red carpet winner <laughs> i'm just interested what people like the best all right let's go next we go leo centovin war from darksiders now i never played darksiders i know it's a game i know they actually made a second one i think it was free on xbox live at one point anyways Desert Sorcerer's Hood, Mastodon Armor, Smelter Demon uh, Gauntlets, Leggings of Ores, the Visible Pair. If you don't have that, then you can use Seeing. Well, we do have that because it's Fashion Souls, and let's do this. Boom. I hate this one. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry, Leo Centovina. I don't like this one. I don't think that it fits together well. The hood sort of fits with the leggings, but this whole middle section is just awful to me. I hate it. I don't like it. Put it in the comments below. Tell me what you think. It's crazy. Ugh. Ugh. And, I, you know, I'm not going to pretend to be fashionable. Look, I'm just wearing a freaking Fruit of the Loom white garbage t-shirt. Who cares? But, man, that's bad. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's let's get this crap out of here quickly. Anyways, let's go back to Fetra Life. And Nunakis says, My favorite fashion is dictated mostly by default medium. Uh, heavy armors are so useless that I always end up with the lightest stuff I can find that and looks generally like Lion Warrior headgear, Lion Warrior Desert Sorceress top, Desert Sorceress hands, black leather leggings, or Alva leggings. So we went with the lion. We went with the girl with the very sleek leggings, very sexified, if you will. I think this works better for a woman. For a man, this looks kind of weird. I got to be honest with you. Um, I think it fits together decently well. It's just not my favorite. Something about it really uh, turns me off. I don't know what it is. Uh, definitely not coming back to the red carpet for me anytime soon anyways let's go next almighty oh, dern i've just recently been sporting this for my fashion look that's cool it's very recent helm arch drake helm uh chest executioner armor hands royal swordsman gauntlet legs bone uh king skirt i like that it's all different and it's actually all really different accompanied uh, by the great scythe burning from charcoal pond resin looking sexy wish i could add a screenshot but i am currently away from my console <laughs> Like, he couldn't just go there. All right, anyways. Uh, we're not going to have the bone scythe, but, I, you know, just try to picture it in your head. How cool that may look. Boom, right there. I think it looks uh, pretty damn interesting. Um, this is also not right, is it? <laughs> no, this is not right. Let me fix this up real quick. I swear I did it correctly in the beginning. Uh, yeah, that's me being dumb. Anyways, Executioner... All right, now we're we're now obviously you can see the helmet is a little bit over. It's like a picture pasted, so it's not as perfect as obviously in the game. But you know you do what you can. 
bone king skirt okay all right i actually i think this fits together well except for the helmet i think the helmet really throws this off maybe in game it might be uh looking a little darker but i think it really throws this off um the helmet i would say change the helmet i would say even almost change it to maybe the penal mask might work better with this because you have this open mid-tier here uh yeah, I don't know. Not my favorite because of the helmet. Other than that, you know, you take the helmet. Let's just let's look what it looks like with the penal, the penal mask. Uh, what is it down there? I mean, obviously the penal mask looks a little weird here because it's this website, but I think that looks a little bit better, personally. Um, I don't know. Tell me what you think. Let's go with the next one. Uh, our our get lamb 350. My latest build, I've been using Hey Knight Iron Mask, Alpha Body, Knight Leggings, and Elite Knight Gauntlets. Looks really cool. Boom, right there. Very similar to the one earlier. Uh, not that one. Very similar to that. Whoops. Ah, damn it. I went too far. I went too far. You weren't supposed to see that. All right. Uh, <laughs> very similar. Uh, I like it. I think the... I, what looks like here is the uh, Knight's Gauntlets are actually two different types of gauntlets, which is a little strange. I kind of like it, but I don't know if I like it for this type of armor. And I think the leggings actually sort of throw this slightly off. Again, I could be wrong. But I think I like the other version better, personally. Whatever. Anyways, next we go with Steve Opesi. I like running around the great club. I love this. You know, he, he sort of sets the mood and sets the tone of what his character is. Uh, great club while wearing the full prisoner set. The hood is the wraparound head injury one, not the peekaboo bandit mask one, and the tatters are the single strap sleeveless model. And boom, that's what we have here. Just think of this guy with the gigantic great club. And uh, I can see that working. I can see that happening. You know, you got somebody who's like the bare minimum piece of trash homeless man, and he's just running around and he beats you up with the gigantic club. I like that aspect of it. I don't like any of this armor set because it is just trash. You know, it's just like, oh, I've been wearing this for 144 years, passed down from every generation of life forever, and this is what it turned out to be. No, I hate it. <laughs> I hate that, but I like the concept of your guy is just running around with garbage all over him, but he beats you and great clubs you to death like a little baby seal jerk from Canada in that dark lighter. What are you doing? Anyways. Let's go over to uh, Azorius the Paladin. Uh, he puts out the. Uh, he actually gave three, and I'll, I'll you know I'll, I'll put the three up on the screen. He, he gives three, but he said the one I picked was the Drake Blood Helm, Rames Armor, King's Gauntlets, Charred Lois Leggings. Let's see what that looks like. What this looks sick. I gotta say, when, you know, when I was pre-setting all these up, it looks awesome. Um, this one, it's just dark on dark on dark on awesome. I gotta say, I'm a huge fan of this, and I think I'm probably gonna steal this and use this, and then pretend it's mine and tell everybody I made it, and put it in videos, and all that. <laughs> so awesome for Azorius the Paladin. Spectacular. I really like this. The dark goes with the dark which goes with the dark. It's all like rough around here and has holes here. Oh, so at least for me, I think it's awesome. Let's go to Johnny Harpoon. He says, for male, a lawn knight armor with no helmet. For female, anything involving flowing robes and a lion mage helm. Yeah, he didn't really get too specific, so I just went with the male, a lawn knight without the helmet, boom. Um, it looks cool. It's a full set, you know, or it's a full set, you know. Um, I think that that takes away points. I like more originality in my red carpet pick. So this isn't going to be it because of its unoriginality, I guess. But, you know, it, it looks fine. You know, what, usually sets go together pretty well. So nothing really, you can really say about that. Uh, Jerry Triple 7 says, um, uh, I actually forgot which one I picked on this one. Oh, okay. So he actually puts out four different ones. And I'll put it on the screen here. But he put, uh, the one I picked was the Judgment Helm, Chaos Robe, uh, Robe, Engraved Gauntlets, and Chaos Boots for Staff of Wisdom, Blue Flame, and Watcher's Great Sword character. Now, cool that he has all these different awesome characters. I really appreciate that going into the specifics because 
a lot of Fashion Souls is based around the weapon too, I will admit. But, you know, for sake of just time management and not killing myself with all this work, <laughs> I just stuck with this. It would be cool if they, they try to add uh, some sort of weapon. It looks like it's just picture overlays, which, you know, is the e easier way to do it. It's still pretty cool, though. Um, but let's look at it anyway, and it goes something like this. Now, I, I got to say, I picked the wrong one. <laughs> All right, th this wasn't the one uh, that I originally picked. I just can't remember in my brain. So he actually gets two mentioned. Anyways, this is Velsat's Helm. Uh, Little Whelm armor, Drake Blood Gauntlets, and King's Leggings for my overlevel quality character. Okay, now I like this build overall. Just something with the Velsat's helmet. I don't like the Velsat's helmet for some reason. It sort of reminds me of uh, I think there's an X Men character. Maybe it's like a, a Sentinel or something like that, or I don't know, Magneto mixed with something else. I don't know. Well, regardless, something about this just doesn't fit right with me, if you will. Um, just the helmet everything else. I think is pretty damn cool. I like it a lot You know the black the black, you know black is very fashionable. This is something I know <laughs> Okay, let's go next uh, We got uh, the gray hawk he says thief mask Creighton's chain armor Creighton's chain gloves from boots This is my go-to outfit boom. I am NOT the biggest fan again You know, it's usually like one part that sort of sets it away think that the thief mask is a little bit too dark um it does sort of go together as some sort of thievery chainmail jerk who runs around oh i can't get slashed at all i can just steal everything and you can't do anything about it you get poked you're in bad shape buddy i'm sorry that's what this terrible garb looks like uh, not my favorite i gotta say not my favorite let's go next to godless crom he says uh sanctum knight's helm Forlorn armor, forlorn gauntlets, forlorn leggings. Looks awesome, in my opinion. What sucks is I can't actually show that because uh, they don't have that in this program, the Scholar of the First Sin. That's where it is specifically for Dark Souls 2 on PS4. I think the revamped version for computer and, um, and Xbox One. So they don't have that on this site. I couldn't show it, so I think I just made something random. Made something random. I made like a freaking uh, a hipster hoodlum jerk who runs around and he does parkour and he thinks he's a badass and thinks he's fashionable with this light color and he wants to be noticed. Yeah, he's not winning the red carpet. He's a jerk. <laughs> um, uh, the most unique and fashionable look in Dark Souls 2 is obviously from JT Destroyer 5900. Uh, Full Havels with Jester Top. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. You have never seen this before. You have never seen this person with an Ice Rapier or a Chaos Blade. This is just the best red carpet winner ever. I should shut everything off. Do, 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 whatever. It, that's it. You win. There you go. You won. You won. You did it. JT Destroyer, you have done it. You've won. You've found the most. Okay, no. We're kidding. It's not the best. This is just... This is for... Uh, if you will try hard builds i don't mind if anybody uses it but um it, it's like i want to win so i'm going to use something similar to this and whatever i don't think it's fashionable though it looks pretty dumb um then uh we'll go to chayo kaginuma chio kaginuma he says bell helm Bandit armor, invisible uh, armor of aura, smelter gauntlets, smelter leggings, or judgment set with the dark helm. Now, I went with the judgment set with the dark helm because for some reason, even though they have all the other armors, it doesn't have the old bell helm in this. I don't know why that is. Very strange. But let's look at it anyway. I think this looks pretty cool. I love this mask. It's one of my favorite uh, uh, helmets or whatever in the game. I love the dark, just everything. Everything dark looks awesome. So that's, you know, that's up there. That's definitely up there uh, on the list of red carpet awesomeness. Certain robes I think look cool. I think Targray's robe, that's one of my favorite robes. It's pretty cool. Uh, this works pretty well. Um, I think the this part of the robe is a little, I don't know. I don't like that part. Let's, let's put on a female, see if it changes anything. Uh, female actually makes it a little better because it makes it a little bit smaller. I think very svelte characters look a little bit better. Anyways, let's go to the next. Last but not least, ladies and gentlemen, in at Darklighter, he does it 
once again. I can't believe it. Ladies and gentlemen, in and out Dark Lighter, he says, actually, you know what? Let me just show you what he says. Boom. That's right. No armor, garb, or clothing whatsoever. Loincloths are pretty damn fashionable. That's what he goes with in F Dark Lighter. Always here for some comedy relief. I love it. There are people who actually use this, though. Like, that's not a joke or anything. Like, people use this and, you know, you weigh basically nothing except for whatever your weapon is. And that's about it. Uh, I've seen people use it effectively. I've also destroyed people with using it ineffectively so that's how it happened and then let's just look at my build i well i just made one up because i thought it's fun to mess around with this sometimes just go on here it's free why not you don't even need to log in or sign in but i made this uh crate and steel mask one of my favorite masks in the game uh, i think i'm not sure if in the game if this chainmail part goes under i think it does go under the um the mid uh the chainmail, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I could be wrong. Uh, so I use Hay Knight chainmail, Barom gauntlets. Uh, one thing I don't like is the little bit of skin showing here. Uh, I try to take that out, but I think in game you probably wouldn't see it. And ironclad leggings, just for like that very tree trunk base look. Let's see how it looks on female. For some reason that got darker, I swear. I swear this whole thing got darker, actually. Hold on, wait a second. It definitely did. This is hilarious. But uh, I think it looks pretty cool. You should try it out, you know. Um, I would actually, I really would, as far as soul, uh, Red Carpet Souls goes, I would put this in the running for top three, personally, out of what I've seen. But I do really appreciate all your entries. And what do I pick, though? Should I pick Inept Dark Lighters? Should I pick this dumb Rune Helm? Our rune sentinel that i hate should i pick this one that actually really fits together very well well i will eliminate this one because they use too much of the th same uh armor and i think that's a little cheap on the fashion sold business no i think you know what i'm gonna pick not that one not that one definitely not that one yes that's right this one uh <laughs> on i have to count how many that is that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All right. So that's the eleventh person, and that is okay. This is the person I actually brought in three, and I did pick the best one, so they got sort of an unfair advantage. Sorry for everybody else who entered in the contest of amazingness, but yes, Azorius the Paladin has destroyed it. Struck gold. I think this is an awesome set. I seriously am going to use this if I can remember. It's sick. It's awesome. Fashion Souls almost at its finest. I think uh, the other front one, uh, runner is uh, this one by. Uh, I think this one's by something. Oh, this one's by uh, Chio Kagonuma. But the problem with this one is too many judgment areas here. So that's that's why that one failed and was out. But winner, like I said, I love this set. It's awesome. They're all different. They all fit together. It's fantastic. Of course, this is, uh, except for the Drake Blood, everything else is twinkling. So that kind of sucks. Either way, one thing i have noticed with this there are few armor sets that just ruin everything else you can't wear one piece of it and sort of have it fit with other pieces and i'm just going to show you one of them <laughs> because it is very dumb it's it doesn't work well and one weird thing is they have this which i don't think they have you can't actually have in the game but they have it somehow but it, it doesn't work well and Let's see if I can I can find it. All right. If you pick Katarina, it just ruins every armor. Onion Bro just ruins everything. Let, let's just look at this. Look. Look, as you can see, it just destroyed it. All right, let, let's look at something else. Let's, all right, let's, uh, let's get the Katarina leggings. Let's see what happens here. Oh, wow. Well, you know, actually, this doesn't look as horrible as I suspected, but it still does look weirdly frumpy on the bottom. Huh. All right, let's go over here. Let's go with the uh, Katarina mask here. Huh. Oh my goodness, that looks so stupid. Wow, 
this armor set just ruins everything. I don't know, let's let's check this out. The gauntlets. Oh my goodness, why does that look dumb? That that one just ruins everything. Another one that I, I've noticed that sort of ruins a lot of fashion souls is the uh wow, apparently they don't have it? Well I thought hmm. Maybe it's not Maybe I'm dumb. Alright, well I was gonna put the butterfly armor, but I guess they don't have it unless I'm I don't remember what the name is. I'm sorry, this is a little bit un unprofessional of me, but bear with me. That's weird, I swear they it's butterfly. I, unless I'm just dumb. I might be dumb. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Either way, that one I think ruins a lot of them because it's a super bright orange and it just destroys everything. And yeah, that, that one's a, a little bit rough. They might not have that. I don't know. Heh. Leggings of Oris. L let's see what the invisible one looks like. Ha! That's. Oh, alright. <laughs> At first, I'm like, what? That's terrible. They just. Because they. It's pictures. They didn't know how to do that, but. Looks like they actually like drew that one in or something. Um, yeah. Anyways, Fashion Souls, Fashion uh, hyphen Souls. dot com is is pretty cool. It's just you know, just to see what things look like. Maybe you just are bored on a train or in a car ride or whatever. It's just fun. It's fun to look at it. Um, have fun with it. There you go. There's there's your your portion here. There's your answer portion. I don't know what else to tell you. Fashion Souls, awesome. Dark Souls too, awesome. It's you know, it's just. Just mess around with it you know not everything is about the stats a lot of people think you know they, they want to try hard and have all the stats so just have fun with it love it learn it live it and uh i will be back like comment subscribe thank you